Hey everyone, today I want to talk to you about an influential leader named Billy Graham. Martin Luther King Jr. once said, had it not been for the ministry of my good friend Dr. Billy Graham, my work in the civil rights movement would not have been as successful as it has been. Ultimately, many of you be, may be unfamiliar with the works of the evangelical leader Billy Graham, but this well-known Christian leader left an inspiring impact on America through his mission to share the gospel to the world. Many of you may have heard the well-known evangel evangelist Billy Graham, but may be unaware of just how big of an effect he has had on society and Christianity as a whole. It serves us all well to know about the influential leaders who are looked up to and respected, and knowing about Billy Graham and his mission tackles one of the people who made a huge impact on the world with his leadership. Since I've grown up in a Christian home, I've always heard of the name Billy Graham, and turning on one of his sermons in the morning was always a family tradition. Today, I'd like to share with you the history, the journey, and the impact Billy Graham has had on sharing the gospel to the world. To begin with, I would like to give you a brief history of Billy Graham's early life. He was born on November 7, 1918 in Charlotte, North Carolina. He was raised on a dairy farm along with his two siblings, and he was not the smartest in school, but he loved to read. His parents were Calvinists, so he can thank Evangelical Mordecai Ham for the sermons that spoke to him during the revival that inspired him to become the great evangelist he was. Graham attended Bob Jones College in Tennessee, but eventually transferred to the Florida Bible Institute because he was struggling in school. He had a mentor named John Mender, who was invited to speak at a small Baptist church, but Mender said no and suggested that Billy take over the service instead, which sparked his evangelistic career. He was ordained in 1913 after joining a Southern Baptist Convention Church. Now that you are familiar with the early life of Graham, we can continue to talk about his path to becoming an evangelist. Billy Graham began by being a guest on Stuart Hamblin's radio show in 1949. The doors then opened for him to come and broadcasting his sermons to the world. He was a pastor for the First Baptist Church in Western Springs, Illinois, and after that, he then led Youth for Christ, which focused on sharing the gospel to servicemen and young people. He then quit to focus on Northwestern schools and soon resigned from that to focus more on the preaching. It says in Billy Graham's bibliography from bibliography.com that Graham began broadcasting in sermons over the radio during a Christian song called Songs of the Night. One week, he hosted a program called The Hour of Decision, a program ABC transmitted to 150 stations before reaching its peak of 1,200 stations across America. Can you imagine being heard from 1,200 different stations? This is what led Graham to being as well-known as he is. Although learning about the early life and path of Graham's career, it is pointless if you don't know about the impact he has had on the world as a whole. He has reached 215 million people in live audiences in more than 185 different countries and territories. Millions more were reached through media. In 2005, he also slowed down due to his health from Parkinson's disease. In an article titled Billy Graham's Legacy by World News, Graham stated that he hopes he is faithful in preaching the gospel throughout his life. He influenced many church leaders and defined and shaped the evangelical movement. Graham died at age 91 on February 21, 2018, but what an impact this amazing man has had on the world. To conclude, Billy Graham has had a huge impact on the world as a leader and his influence. We have discussed Graham's early life, his journey to become a successful evangelist, and his impact on sharing the gospel to the world. Now that you are more familiar with this important leader, you will be able to impress family and friends with what you know. But more importantly, you will be able to show a newfound respect for evangelical leaders who have been influenced by the great Billy Graham. To conclude, the Christian Broadcasting Network states, In a windstorming change of values and shifting circumstances, Graham is still the point in the American moral universe. He has maintained for six decades the same message, the same seemingly untroubled convictions, the same unblemished ethical record, and in an age of anxiety calmed the national soul. Billy Graham, the motivator, the leader, and the evangelist. Thank you for listening.